Hello, I'm Brittany Harry. And I'm Justin Fisher, and welcome to the very last Arrow sneak peek of this semester. To start things off this week, we take a look at the portal everyone keeps talking about. Over Thanksgiving break, Southeast Missouri State University's Information Technology Department rolled out the new system. Many of you were asking exactly why the new system was released in the middle of a semester instead of waiting for winter break. Well, the Arrow learned that the decision was made because Thanksgiving break was the time the site would see the least use. You can check that out on page four of the paper or online. And Christmas spirit was in the air in Cape Girardeau on Friday. From 5 to 9 p.m., Old Town Cape held the Downtown Christmas Open House. Shops were open later, holding deals to attract would-be shoppers into their business. Carolers were also stationed all around downtown to bring that extra bit of holiday spirit into the air. Santa was also in attendance to take pictures with the young kids, and a free horse and carriage ride were also available. But of course, that line was incredibly long. <laughs> the open house wasn't the only holiday-themed event this weekend. Old Town Cape also held the 24th annual Parade of Lights. The parade was originally scheduled for November 29th, but due to inclement weather, it was moved to December 6th. The parade started at Kappa Hall Park and moved down Broadway, where it ventured on to Main Street. You can see that holiday story on our website at southeastarrow.com. Now on to sports. The Red Hawk Success Center is going to see some improvements over winter break. Through some privately funded money, renovations will include an indoor turf and some new equipment for the players. This will allow the football team to work out in much larger groups where right now they have to break off into much smaller ones. That project will cost around $500,000. You can check out these stories and much more online at southeastarrow.com. That's right. You can also follow us to stay up to date on all things happening on campus by liking us on Facebook and following us on Twitter and Instagram. We'll see you next semester.